Hooray for Hollywood. Hello there. Stan the Movie Man here. With the WIMZ.com Movie Review this week, I gave you several options. Art films, previously released films, and the one new release this week entitled The Golden Compass. You instead sent me to see Hitman. I don't know what I've ever done to you. I'll try never to do it again. Hitman is the story based on the video game of Agent 47, a hitman trained since birth, along with other children who are brought up to be hitmen uh, for this very shadowy organization. He's bald, as are all the other assassins in this league, uh, and has a barcode on the back of his head. Now, if you're trying to be a secret organization, wouldn't you think you'd want them to blend into society? I think the barcode on the back of the head would be a dead giveaway. Pardon the expression. Uh, so anyway, Timothy Olyphant plays Agent 47, and he's been sent to Russia to kill the Russian president. He succeeds in that, but the next day a guy shows up on TV who survived the assassination attempt. And also the organization that Agent 47 works for has now sent killers after him. The movie has no great reason to exist other than to spray a lot of fake blood around and give a bunch of uh, uh, stuntmen some work for a day or two. Uh, it has no real story to speak of. It's just a way uh, uh, to get from one action sequence to the other. And the action sequences are pretty good. Uh, there's, a, there's, a, there's a lot of really interesting action sequences in the film, but Action sequences do not make a well-rounded movie. Uh, there are a few characters you care about, but pretty much everyone in the film is out to either kill someone or to avoid being killed, or uh, they're trying to use people in some other way. They're drug dealers or they're pimps or, you know, whatever. So, uh, you know, there's really, not to, there's really not a whole lot to suggest you go see the film. Other than if you're an action fan, or if you're just a huge fan of the video game Hitman, so that uh, you want to see how they translated it to the screen. I personally didn't think it was a very good translation, primarily because there's not a lot of story. It's just getting from one action sequence to the, ne to the next, and that's why I'm giving it to guitars. Go to WIMC.com. To read my complete review as well as to vote on the movie that I'll see next week, I'm begging you to do a better job next time. Until next time, stay in the movie, man. See ya.